a car out of one. I pray this devil died and did every evil thing the Lord got to get. And listen, I know you look at us in the state we in right now. Call me out, Call me out, Call me out, I know you look at us in the state we in right now, black people on drugs, and we suffering and dying. And I know it seems like you can do whatever you want to this people. I know it seems like this, but the time for glorifying yourself is soon at an end. My topic is sickness and disease. Many of us blacks and Hispanics, we are dying of sickness and disease. And guess what? This is found in the Bible. And why is it found in the Bible? Because this Bible is a book talking about us. It is talking about the black man and the Hispanic man. Right. I'm gonna show you that our people are dying of all kinds of sickness and diseases. This is found within the Bible. Get me Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 15. So I'm gonna show the black man and the Hispanic man that our people dying of diseases is found in the Bible. And this happens because why? We don't want to we don't want to obey the Lord. So give me Deuteronomy 28 and verse 15. Deuteronomy 28 and 15. But it shall come to pass if thou will not hearken unto the Lord the voice of the Lord thy God to observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes which I command thee this day Read. that all these curses all these what? all these curses all these curses a curse is a punishment from God so now, God, so now God he's letting them know if they don't follow his law, statutes and commandments all these curses are going to come upon him be done that all these curses shall come upon thee and overcover thee and overtake them meaning anywhere they go that curse is going to be with them also from there skip to verse 61 so we show you that blacks and hispanics dying of diseases is found in the bible and it is prophesied in the bible also showing us that this book is only talking about us if you're on this sign black man hispanic man this bible is talking about you that's right so from there um verse 61 Deuteronomy 28 and 61, also every sickness. Every what? Every sickness. So now God is telling the blacks and Hispanics, every what? Every sickness. Every sickness, read on. And every plague. And every plague, every curse. You dying of cancer is a plague, it's a curse. That's right. You having one foot, it's like you having one foot having to get chopped off. That's a plague. That's, right. That's a curse from God. Read on which is not written in the book of this law. Which is not written in the book of this law. So what diseases are not found in the book of this law? Cancer is not found in the book of this law. Gonorrhea is not found in the book of this law. Herpes is not found in the book of this law. So let's tell you that all these other things which are not written up in the Bible, read on. Not written in the book of this law, read them will the Lord bring upon thee? So them things also will the Lord bring upon us. Why? Because our people are not following the laws of God. So all those other things too, they will also come upon us because we didn't listen to what the Lord had to say. That's right. Um, is there any more in verse right. 1? Until thou be destroyed. Until what? Until thou be destroyed. Until we be destroyed. Now look at us. Over 60% of blacks and Hispanics have a disease. So this came upon us until we have been destroyed. Black man, this is found in the Bible. Any more on that? All right, from there, give me Psalm the 107 chapter and the 17th verse. Psalms 107 and verse and the 17th verse. So now we go in the Bible making this point that blacks and Hispanics dying of diseases is found in the Bible. And this will only stop until we return unto the Lord until we follow the laws, statutes and commandments. We got that Psalms 107 and 17 verse. Psalms 107 and 17 read, Fools because of their transgression. And uh, what did the Bible say? Fools because of their transgression. So a fool because he don't want to follow the law, statutes and commandments in the Bible. Read on. And because of their iniquities. Because of their iniquity, because of their sins. Read on. 
are afflicted. They are what? Are afflicted. Cancer. Afflicted. Gonna react. Afflicted. Right. So because they don't do what the Lord says, they get afflicted. That's right. And that's why diseases come upon them because they don't want to obey the Lord. A lot of you think God is Bible. He just all oh, love, love, love. Guess what? If you don't obey His laws, you will get cancer. You will die. God will take your life. And that is found in the Bible. Read that again from the top. Fools, because of their transgression. Read. And because of their iniquity. Because of their sins, what? Are afflicted. They are afflicted. They get a disease. They get cancer. They get some diseases which you can't even imagine. And why does it happen? Because they don't want to follow the laws of God. And this is found in the Bible. The same Bible you can buy in any shop and you can read it for yourself. And if you read it again, tell them where you're reading it. Psalms 107 verse 17. Read. Fools, because of their transgression. Read. And because of their iniquities. Read on. Are afflicted. They are afflicted. Sorry. Read on. Anyone that their soul abhorreth all manner of meat. And they, and they, because they're sick, their soul abhors all manner of meat. Meaning, when you're sick and you're about to die, you don't want to eat. And that's what the Bible's talking about. He brings those kind of plagues which, don't, which do not make a man want to eat. From there, give me Deuteronomy chapter 32 and the 39 verse. So, us at the ISUPK, we're making a point that sicknesses and diseases. They come from the Lord when the blacks and Hispanics do not want to follow the laws of God. And this is found in the Bible and it's found all over the Bible. So when you get that, Deuteronomy chapter 32 and verse 39. Deuteronomy 32 and 39. We see now that I, even I am He. Now, when it says I am He, this is talking about God. We and there is no God with me. And there's no other God with the God of this Bible. That's right. You can't mate him, match him with any other God. Right. There's only the one God. We, I kill and make alive. And um, uh, what does God do? I kill and make alive. Now black man, Hispanic man, this ain't our words. The Bible says God, he kills and makes alive. So when someone dies, that is God. Right. Your grandma that is dead, God killed him. That's right. Your son that is dead, God killed him. Right. Read that part again from the top. Do you know that I, even I, no. am here, and there is no God with me. Read that. I kill. I kill. God says he kills. This is our words. This is the same Bible you can buy anywhere and right. read it for yourself. In the book of where? Deuteronomy. You can read it. It is God. Anybody that dies, that is up to the most high. Read. I kill. And make a life. And he makes a life too. Read. I wound. I wound. What? And I heal. And he heals. So when you're dying, that is up to God. So now, you may think, whoa, whoa, this can't be in the Bible. This is in the same Bible everybody has. But guess what? They don't read the Bible. That's right. They don't understand the Bible. That's right. Us at the ISUPK, only we understand the Bible. That's right. You will not get the understanding of God anywhere else but at the ISUPK. Read that again from the top. See now that I. Even I am he, and there is no God with me. Read. I kill. God kills. Read. And make alive. And he makes alive. If he wants your son to not die, that's up to God too. So guess what? Blacks and Hispanics, if you don't want to die, you need to come back to the laws, statutes, and commandments of God. That's right. If you don't, this is our words. You are going to die. And this right. is in the Bible. We're reading out the Bible. As you can see, the Bible is open. It ain't closed. Black man, it's fatty man. We're reading out the word of God. Read on. I wound. He wounds. Cancer, read. I wound. So now any disease that you get, that is a wound from God. So guess what? Any wound that you get, you got that because you were not following the laws of God. That's right. So black man, it's fatty man. If you, do, so, so, sorry. Black man, it's fatty man. That wound of God, if you don't want that, it's high time that you come back. Come to the school, learn the commandments of God, and the ice UPK, that wound will be gone if you return unto the Lord. That's right. Um, if you can um, continue reading. I wound and I heal, neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. And there, there's none that can deliver out of the hand of the Most High. That's right. If God wants you to have that disease, you are going to have that disease. That's right. He wants you to die, then you are going to die. That's right. You cannot deliver out of the hand of God. 
And guess what? Our people have not been taught the truth according to the word of God. You'll be taught lies. And that's why when we are out here telling you that a disease comes from God, people are shocked and surprised. But guess what? It ain't up to us. It's because why? You have been taught lies for many years. That's right. You don't know the Bible. And this is the ICPK. We're going to teach the black man and his white man the truth according to the word of God. So now, how do you get that disease away from they give me Psalms? 103 and verse 1 so now the, so now the answer is in the Bible too if you get that disease and you want a gun you have to return unto the Lord and that answer is is also in the Bible too so the ice should be we are only out here for the people and the sign if you are not on the sign this is not for you we're only teaching to the people and the sign when you get that Psalms 103 and verse 1 Psalms 103 and 1 bless the Lord Oh my soul and all that is within me, Read. bless his holy name, Read on. bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits, Read on. who forgiveth all thine iniquities, who does what? Forgiveth all thine iniquities. So first off, if you get a disease, you need to return to the Lord. Let me speak apart again from the top. Who forgiveth all thine iniquities? And when you return to the Lord, anything you've done, He will forget about that. Why? Because now you are following the Lord's statute and commandments. That's the only way that disease will be gone. If you don't return, that disease is going to be your death. And that's not our words. That is found within the Bible. Read on. Who healeth? All thy diseases. Who does what? Healeth all thy diseases. So God, He can heal your disease if you return unto the Lord. And that answer is found in the Bible. We're not reading it out in the book except the Bible. To heal your disease, you have to return unto the Lord. And if you don't, then that disease will always remain. And that disease will be the death of the black and the Hispanic man. That's right. He does not return. Is there any more on that? Who redeemeth? thy life from destruction and there you dying of a disease is destruction and guess what if you return he will redeem your life from that destruction that's right and that's found in the bible black man is Hispanic man you don't need to go anywhere else your answers are found in your book in the bible and it's about time that you return and that and also the ice should be came we're calling for the black man and his Hispanic man to return unto the lord Smart manhood. Uh -huh. Hey, black women.